blog you quoted the psychologist from ASU saying people in power sometimes rationalize bullying behaviors by saying they're trying to build mental toughness in their players. What, what does mental toughness really mean? What mental toughness really means is being able to overcome adversity, being able to be uh, honest and truthful with yourself during failure, being able to overcome coaches or players who do not have your best intentions uh, at heart or in mind. You're going to get a lot of coaches who their mentality of dealing with players is being abusive. Mentally abusive, emotionally abusive, psychologically abusive. Um, and, and that never creates successful athletes. Um, you really have to have a strong core to be able to withstand that and to have mental toughness training and understanding of how to deal with these types of people, these types of situations, um, builds confidence because you know that if put in that situation, if dealing with those circumstances that you can truly overcome them and you can possibly help teach that person a lesson that, hey, being abusive is not productive and you're not going to help uh, influence me you know, you're not going to help um, make the team better with that kind of attitude so uh, having mental toughness and having confidence um, you can you can build a better team you can really help shape your environment that way rather than just being a passive observer uh, you can actually be a very active player and, and in my mind the players who had that ability they created opportunities for themselves. They created friendships, and they were the, the leaders of every team that I was on. Go to sportsmentaltoughness.com to get your free video training and guided visualization MP3 on how to perform under pressure. I'm Craig Sigal, the Mental Toughness Trainer.